So how do you differentiate yourself amongst the sea of artists and photographers? What is the most successful marketing tactic? What is the secret to success? These are questions that I get all the time from artists and photographers all over. They all want to know what's the what's the quickest way, what's the secret, you know, what's how do I differentiate myself and all these different things and they're searching on Google, they're searching everywhere for all this stuff. Well, I'm going to tell you exactly what the differentiator is. You want to know what it is? All right. It is doing the work. It's doing consistent marketing all year long, okay? For one, two, three years. It's working on a real business like a real business owner, okay? You talk to any entrepreneur in any industry, not just the art business, but absolutely the art business. Talk to any successful artist and photographer. They had to do consistent marketing all year long. You don't just send a couple of emails here and there, some social media posts. Oh, it didn't work. You know, you try a few different things and uh, and just expect that fish are going to jump into your boat. It doesn't work that way. It is the funniest thing I've ever heard. Whenever we whenever we promote successful artists on our platform, like this artist did two hundred thousand dollars in one year, or this one did you know fifty thousand dollars in the fourth quarter. I'm always blown away at the reactions. It's it's hilarious. Uh, the comments on 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 Facebook posts, um, email replies that we get. Everybody is always trying to you know, chop that artist down to, or the photographer to like, oh, it was, it was because they had augmented reality on their website. Oh, it was because of their website features. That's what it was. Or, oh, it was because, you know, their content, um, or whatever they got lucky. And the funniest part is nobody ever reaches out to talk to that actual artist or photographer to find out because the thing that they would find out is that person did the consistent marketing work all year long. And for one, two, three, four, five years, they did it. That's the differentiator. And you, so when you think about it, the reason it's the differentiator, the reason that it's the secret is because nobody's going to do it. The vast majority of people out there and, you know, probably, probably many of you watching this right now, your first reaction, your mind wants to tell you, no, 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 I don't want to do that work. I don't have time to do all of that work. Yes, you do. Nobody had time. Nobody had the time. It's how bad do you want it? How bad do you want that lifestyle? How bad do you want, you know, to be a full-time, you know, career artist or to have decent side income coming in? How bad do you want it? Because uh, if, if your mind goes in the wrong direction, you're going to be just like 99.99999% of the artists and photographers that are out there that are not willing to do the work, that are making, you know, their own excuses. They give up extremely quickly. They try a few things and, and, and they don't go well. So they give up. Everybody just gives up. That's what everybody does. Nobody puts in the work. And so that is the differentiator. And, uh, and it's so obvious because, you know, we've talked about this in other videos that, that I've made and, and that we've made as a company. And um, all the time on our platform at Art Storefronts, we see artists and photographers who do the consistent work all year long. They outsell world-renowned artists and photographers that are also on our platform you know, that are published in magazines and have, you know, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of Instagram followers. Um, and they outsell them, they outperform them. And those people are not doing the work, you know, the, the world renowned ones. And, and so it's, it's incredible to see, it's incredible to see like average, you know, I, I don't even want to say average in terms of the talent, talent level. I'm just saying, you know, unknown, you know, nobody knows who these people are. They didn't have some big list artists and photographers doing the actual consistent marketing work like a business owner needs to be doing and having great success, you know, a year into it, two years, three years, you got to put in the work. And because nobody is willing to do it and everyone wants to make up excuses, that's how you become one of the rare few. That's it. And so I find it, I find it, uh, I find it so funny as I was saying a second ago, because you know, when I talk to people, I'm like, you know, what are you searching for? What are you Googling for? And like, well, I'm, you know, I Google for, you know, what tool can I use? What, what, what marketing tactic, you know, is going to get me the best, you know, return on, uh, that I can do next, you know, um, what, what gallery, what other gallery websites can I upload my art to that a million bajillion other people are uploading to every single day, right? They're, they're all looking for the wrong things. The, the, the one thing the only thing that they should be looking for is where can I get 
a proven marketing plan that I can follow that can make it really easy for me so I can do this work all year long, you know, and for the next couple of years, where can I get mentors? Where can I hire a consultant? You know, or where can I, where can I get somebody to do consulting for me? This is the differentiator, right? So you would think that's the product that everybody would be looking for, but they're not because everybody's looking in the wrong place. And that's why there's a bajillion starving artists. Nobody's willing to do the work. Everybody's quits, quits, quits right when anything gets tough or, you know, when, when, when they've got out of line expectations, like, you know, you do marketing for six months and you should be a, you know, a millionaire by that point. Like that's not how it works for any business. So if you have the right expectations and, and you go about this the right way, you can be one of the rare few. It's amazing. I mean, this video is, you know, tens of thousands of people, maybe hundreds of thousands will see it. And, uh, and it, it, it still won't matter. It still won't matter because so many people, like, like I said, 99.999%, they just won't do the work. So it doesn't really matter. But if you do it, you can make it. So, um, another thing is that like, uh, one of the things that bothers me is, is it's become so easy to launch a business these days. There's a lot of articles about this just in general in business magazines or, you know, news sites that with software, with these easy to use website template companies that you're probably familiar with. It's so easy for any individual to launch a website, just like it's, you know, people have iPhones or anybody can buy a camera. Everybody's got a camera in their pocket. It's really easy for anyone to be a photographer, right? It's so much easier for anybody to try to do this type of stuff. Well, that's why it's so important to differentiate yourself more than ever and figure out how to do that. But, but, uh, the problem with that is, is that it's easier than ever to launch a business, but having a website doesn't mean you have a business. You don't have a business if you just have a website. You just, all you have is just a website. You have a tool. You have a business when you've got a marketing program that is working. That's it. When you have a marketing program that you are running consistently, that is bringing in consistent you know, growth in your email list and consistent growth in buyers, then you have a business, but until then you don't have anything. So that's a problem that everyone needs to solve. And launching a website doesn't do anything to help you there. You're going to run into this problem one way or another, and it's going to cost you, you know, a lot of time and money, um, in order to fix it. So, uh, it's, it just is what it is. So, um, this is why we at art storefronts, like a lot of people don't know that yes, we have incredible, art gallery website software with, you know, 50, hundred times more art selling features than our nearest competitor. Um, but the reality is, is that the marketing product that, that we have is the most exciting thing that we have by far. It's the thing that everybody should be asking about, but they don't, they love the shiny features. They love to go through a demo, you know, looking at the wall preview tool and the augmented reality where you can use your phone and see the art on your own wall and in, in your home and all of that. But that stuff is automated. Like that stuff, you, you know, you buy it and it works on your website. It has, you don't have to do anything, right? Like that's going to be working for you when you're bringing, you know, traffic and exposure uh, and getting more exposure so that people are coming in and actually going to your site, going to your art gallery and using these tools. That's why you need the marketing. But the marketing product has a, a, a ton of bells and whistles to it. It's incredible. And we're constantly trying to make it easier and easier and easier every single year and to make it more thorough, to provide more templates and examples and anything that we can do to save everyone time. Because we know that if we can make it the easiest thing on the planet to do like consistent marketing and to do like really thorough, really good marketing, then more people are going to do it here and more people are going to be successful, right? So it's the whole thing. And it's the thing that everybody should be asking about, you know, and wanting to see, um, on their demos and things like that. And so I, I find that kind of funny, but, but, uh, um, we've productized, you know, art marketing and, uh, and in doing that, it's become like any other product, something that just gets better and better and better every year, which allows, you know, every artist and photographer to get better and better and better. So, um, I can imagine what many of you are feeling right now. Uh, some of you are probably like, gosh, you know, I wasn't looking to hear that this was going to be a lot of work or, you know, anything like that. And, you know, while things can be made, you know, a lot simpler than you think, it's not, it's not that hard of work, but 
it's really the mindset of the whole thing. And if you have the mindset of like, oh no, like I, I'm going to run away from this. I'm going to run away from, from, from doing any marketing or anything like that. You're running away from growing a business period. Like it, this is not my opinion. You can talk to anyone in any industry running any business. Like you can't, you can't run away from like building a, a marketing strategy. So uh, if, if, if that's the case, then you know, you're probably just going to struggle. But for the rest of you, the few of you who, who, who know this deep down and you know that this is the truth and, and you want to do it and you want to do it the right way, then you know what you need to do. You need to, you need to do this consistent marketing. This is how you become one of the rare few. This is how when you're like, you just have to think about it logically, right? If there's a gazillion people out there doing like landscape photography or something, right? I'm just going to use that as a very general term. Um, and you're the one doing consistent marketing all the time and your art is getting in front of more eyeballs, dramatically more eyeballs than anyone else and consistently so that these people remember you and they know who you are and they're, they're, they're building an emotional connection through your romance marketing that you should be doing. Then when it comes time to buy the art, you're going to be the person in the lead. You're going to be in the number one spot. You're probably going to get that sale before anyone else, before these people even know about these other landscape photographers, right? There could be other people with better images, way better talent, but they're not getting seen. So it doesn't even matter. You're not even competing against them. The competition is so low because nobody is actually doing the marketing. It's actually, it's, it's incredible. And that's why it is, it is the secret to success. It's what everybody over here is doing to be successful. You look at our, uh, you, you, you look at our reviews, um, and, 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 you know, there's hundred over a hundred or 200 five-star reviews. And you, and you look at people who are talking about the sales success that they've had. It is not because of anything else aside from following the marketing product, you know, doing the work, uh, uh, throughout the week and throughout the month, you know, there's, there's, uh, there's the quicker plan. There's the more advanced plan. There's things for people who don't have a lot of time. It, it doesn't matter, but it's the people who have been following the marketing all year long and consistently after it, that's who's having the success. It is not any other trick or simple hack. It's as simple as that. So the real question is, what are you going to do now that you have this information? You know what to do. You know exactly what to do now. I've just given it to you, but are you going to do it, right? So think about that. And, uh, and I really hope that you do. I really hope to you know, see your comments and, and, and come back a year from now or two years from now, three years from now, remembering that somebody told you the truth that you're going to have to do consistent marketing. And that's the way, that's the way to get there. And, and you become one of the rare few and I want to hear about it. So I look forward to hearing that from a lot of you guys. But anyways, I hope that this helps a lot of you out there and, uh, and, and that you, you make it over the hump mentally and you make that decision that you're going to do it and you're going to go for it and, uh, and that your life changes as a result.